OK Guys business is almost over soon. By now you guys must have saved a plenty of snowflakes and gingerbread bears. And in this video I will be telling you guys the best items to buy from the cat lounge. The first thing I would recommend buying is the present. This is because it gives some nice rewards and buffs for you to have. Okay, the second thing you should buy is the festive planter. This is because it can give lots of nice rewards when planted. However, it is a little bit pricey, so you can leave it and save up for another bundle. Okay, the violet bundle is a bundle I would 100% recommend buying. Since it has a bunch of purple, potions plus other rewards. And the bundle is not that expensive. After that I would recommend buying the dicey bundle. The reason being is that it is not that expensive and can help you a lot while you are boosting. Ok guys comment down what bundle you are saving up for. Currently I am trying to buy the mythic egg. Alright the next bundle you should get is the sticker bundle. Since the sticker planters can help you get the stickers for your Beesmus quests. The other rewards that it gives are also nice. Ok the next bundle zoo should try and get are the festive and tropical bundle since they both have plenty of nice rewards such as the glitter wax and festive beans if you guys need help farming snowflakes or gingerbread bears i will put my videos in the description okay now for the two biggest bundles in the shop the blessed bean bundle and Merry Mondo Bundle both have really great rewards such as plenty of festive beans, gifted mythic egg and even a turpentine. The only problem is that they cost a lot. They are probably not even possible to get without macro. Ok the last two things I think you guys should buy are the diamond and mythic eggs since they are both really helpful. As you can get closer to making, the diamond mask will get a really good B. Ok guys thanks for watching, I hoped it has helped. If you want to learn the best ways to farm glue watch the video above.